there. Crazy year we're having. Definitely. So we decided to do something for all of our regular customers. We have really missed seeing everybody at all the shows we do throughout the year. So welcome to our small virtual craft show. All right. So we've got stuff here that you would normally buy for your Christmas presents. We've got some of our lower end, more common banks. And then for all of our regular customers that are collectors that we haven't got to see at all this year, we've thrown in some of our older pieces and some of our more unique pieces for you. So throughout, throughout what we do here, we're going to show you a few of our pieces. We actually have two new styles that some of you have maybe not even seen yet. We figure some of you folks out there that are going to be watching our video um, of our virtual craft show here have never been to one of our craft shows before or seen our product. So right now we're going to just take the time to do a little bit of a question and answer of some of the most frequently asked questions that we get asked. And I'm going to kind of portray that little customer here, and Mom is going to portray us as a worker of the craft show. So a little bit about our business firsthand is we are Robinson's Custom Woodworking and Engraving out of Sunbury, Pennsylvania. And uh, my dad is the woodworker. Um, he hand makes all of the products that you see, uh, does a lot of the work personally by hand, um, get some help from us as a family. We all kind of have our, our little part, yeah, we have our part in making this all happen. Um, so mom, like how long have we been making banks? It's almost 25 years now that we've been doing this. 25 years. Yeah. That's kind of crazy to me. So, <laughs> yep. so the, what we keep referring to as banks, like what are these? Explain to us what they are. So we take an antique post office box door, we get the doors, we figure out the combinations, clean them up, fix them up, and then we build a dovetail box, turn them into a, a gourmet piggy bank. Um, you've got to do your combination or key in order to get your, your cash or whatever else you may have stashed in the bank back out. Yeah. So, so she is right. Every bank that you see here actually opens. So we take the time, we figure out all the working combinations, and when you get your bank and you hold it in your hand, they all have a working combination on the bottom. We give you that step-by-step -step process. Some of them do have a key, though, as well. So, like, are they all the same? Do they, are, they all, are they all equal? So we get that question a lot. You know, everybody assumes that these are all the same thing, just a little different on the front. No, definitely not the case. Uh, they range for, in price from $34.95 to, as my husband says, you've got to be kidding. But that's because they range in age as well. We have banks that are as new as the 1980s and as old as the 1800s. Um, that determines a lot of the price point, uh, as well as which wood we put it in. We, we have uh, pine, oak, cherry, walnut. We have a new Wicked line. And then we also have uh, exotic woods, things from other countries. So we really do try to get a price point for everyone. So our prices jump, like she said, from $34.95. We start doing $5 and $10 increments all the way up. So if you've got a budget for a Christmas gift of $50, we can help direct you into that. We're going to put all of these banks that you're seeing right here into an album on our Facebook page, try to give you as much detail about them as you can, and um, let you have that opportunity to purchase them. We also sell our banks on Etsy. Um, so we will put a link in the comments for our Etsy page. Um, we don't list as many on there. Obviously, they like to take their percentage out, and we try to keep our cost as, as affordable as we can for you. So be sure to look. Um, watch the rest of the video here. We're going to go into detail on some of these other rare ones so that if you want to stick around and watch the rest of it, maybe see some of our new pieces, you can do so. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so some of our lowest end and most cost-effective banks that we have are right here featured for you. So we have three styles that start at $34.95, and they are two different variations of a combination and one in a key. And these banks here, this style is actually unique to our area here of central Pennsylvania. These came out of Bucknell University, so we call these our bison bank. Um, when we have them listed even on Etsy and on our Facebook page, we list them as a bison bank. And those are just a unique piece. Uh, maybe we've got some alumni from the area or people that might even work there. Um, so those are, again, $34.95. Um, those start with our plain, generic, uh, regular slots, what we call those, in a pine bank. And we do variations in colors in those. 
This one here also works with a combination. So these are kind of cool. This one here, you would go to E and S one and a half, and you would open up your bank. So like we said, each one is, uh, is unique and um, custom. These ones here are called a private service door, and they open with a key only, no combination needed. From here, our next price point goes to $39.95, and that is this style. This is a chrome Grecian. This door is from 1963, and again, opens up. That opens like an old gym locker combination where you got to go around to the right, go around to the left, and you get to pop open your door. It's kind of like cracking a safe to get your money back every time. So earlier I mentioned our Wicked line. That's something, and it's a process where my husband basically electrocutes the wood. It's Wicked Cool. That's why we've named it our Wicked line. Um, just to show you, give you an idea on some of those, this is what the wood ends up looking like. You end up getting to see, every one turns out different. Um, these are just a couple of samples here that I have that are done up right now. Um, everything that we have to offer you right now in our virtual tour is in pine. However, these can be done in a variety of woods. Okay, everybody. So as we talked about a little bit, our door fronts range from the 1800s to something a little bit more current. Um, everything that you see when you're looking at these shelving units of banks is original when you look at the door fronts. If we get the number uh, front on the door, we try to leave them as original as we can from when we have gotten the door. Unfortunately, there are times where we have to replace the glass. Um, and, you know, it's either chip, broken, maybe missing. And then in that case, we leave that glass blank. We just don't feel it's right to make up a number and put it on there for you. Um, you know, we've got collectors who, who like to purchase these because of the history on them. And uh, so we do that. Um, and at, at that point in time, we can offer you the chance to customize that number. So, again, in these two potentially blank fronts is what we call them that we're offering in our virtual sale. Um, if you maybe have a, an old mailbox number that you're looking to replicate or an old school number, maybe a birthday or a birth year, we can do that for you. It's just a, a gold decal, kind of a red and gold decal similar to this one right here that, that we would put on there for you. So everything, like I said, that you're going to see in our virtual store is going to be completely authentic. Um, if you're buying a bank from the 1800s and it has a number on it, it's going to be the authentic number from when we have gotten the bank. Um, this year has been a super crazy year. Uh, I think we can all attest to that. And we have come up with a special gift for all those 2020 graduates that uh, may have graduated during this pandemic. And we have taken two blank fronts and customized them with the year 2020 on. These are great graduate gifts, maybe a special monumental birthday, maybe even a wedding. Maybe somebody got married this year in 2020. These would make a great gift to someone from this year. So uh, those two there are numbers that we have put on two blank front doors, but everything else that you see is completely authentic. All right, so we're going to take the time right now to highlight just some of our more common pieces. Um, this one right here is our only robot that we have right now. Um, we've had a lot of kids over the years, maybe even some fun adults, that have said, boy, this looks like a face, you know, two eyes, a nose, a mouth. So we have been making these into a robot feature. Um, these still open with working combination. Uh, this one here is B, one and a half, and O. And you would open the door. And you would be able to get your money or your little, you know, trinkets, whatever you're storing in there out. But this one, you know, this is a one-of-a-kind piece that we're listing for our virtual show. This is the only one we have made. Um, and again, you know, this is from the 1950s is when this door front was made. So some of our other common ones, this is also a bullseye, um, same 1950s era. And this bank right here is actually made out of walnut. And this is G2 and a half. 
V2. And again, you're going to open your bank. So this one is one of our deluxe doors. This one comes with the fancy coin slot on the top. These are a little more elongated, um, and they, they kind of commemorate the post office. These are a custom piece that you're only going to get on a Robinson bank. Those are patented and trademarked just to us and are um, cast for us. Uh, my dad and I actually hand drew them. All right, so this style here is called an inverted F. This is from the 1920s, and this works like an old gym locker style combination. So this one you go three times clockwise to GH, counterclockwise past that first setting to FG, and then clockwise to J, and you would turn the knob to open the door. There you go. Look at that. You get your money back out. So this one here is one of our Wicked Banks. Again, it has that deluxe coin slot on the top that you're only going to get on a Robinson bank. And um, all of our Grecian styles, so some of our ones start at $39.95, and um, some of our other styles here, this one is also in one of our number, this is a $44 bank. This would work with that same gym locker style combination as that. So another one of our common styles that we have, this one is called a double dial eagle. And this works just like those bullseyes that you got to go to your special combination. This one is J3 and L. And you would open. Sometimes they're finicky. J3 and L. We got it now, man. So this one is made out of oak. This door is from 1906. So the original number strap on there. Some of those just are a special piece of history. So some of our rarer pieces, some of our oldest pieces, they have some unique features on them. Like this one right here, this is called a dial and pointer. This one is from 1896. And look at that gorgeous beveled glass on there. Again, working combination on there. We have this style here, which is called a black double dial eagle. Again, beveled glass on that door. That is from 1902. So just two, you know, unique, beautiful pieces. We do have some other styles with beveled glass as well. We've got one of our rarest doors. This is called the grill door. This is the oldest. It is from 1877, and this is in an English walnut wood. Um, just kind of a gorgeous combination. This definitely is a collector piece, one of a kind. In 20-some years, we've only ever seen two of these. So, you know, again, just, just rare. That one opens with a key. Sorry, I'm using my left hand there, folks. So, just a gorgeous, gorgeous bank. One of our rare collector pieces for all of our collectors out there that we missed so much this year. Another one of our rare pieces. This one here is an original wooden door. Um, this one works with a combination again, folks. This one is made out of cherry. And this one is from 1883. Really gorgeous piece. Nothing, nothing like you're going to see... On a common on a common basis, even at our stand, some of our rare pieces up here. Again, this belly eagle here on the end is one of our older pieces. This one is also from the 1800s, 1895. I'm going to take the key out just so you can see the beauty of that door. So some of our doors that we have also are the number two and number three size. Um, some people kind of think that maybe those are all more expensive, which isn't always the case. We have a, a number three Grecian here. And that door is going to fall, fall kind of mid-range on a price range. This one's only uh, $74.95. And that door front opens face first. We sell a lot of those for a collectible piece. Um, maybe you have a a coin collection or a pocket watch collection. Maybe you want to stick your pistol in it on your dresser. Um, but they work great for that. The door fronts fold down flat. They're nice and heavy. Some of our other number two size doors you see floating around, those are bigger ones. And then we do have two other styles that I want to talk about real quick. Um, we have two banks left. Um, these two right here, they're both a chrome Grecian, and those are both actually made out of pine. Um, you can see the beautiful dovetailing there on the top. 
Um, those are both doors that came out of Penn State University. Uh, Mom, which office were they out of? Those were Office of Physical Plant. Correct. Yep, Office of Physical Plants, where they came from. Those are our last two Penn State doors. So all you Penn State alumni, uh, we got two more of those left for you. And then the other door front that I want to talk about is um, this style right here. This door is called a, a Zinc Flying Eagle. And we have this door right here, which is a Zinc Daisy Wheel. Those two doors may not be as old as some of our other ones, but they hold a unique part of history. Um, those are both uh, two of the only door styles that were made during World War II. Um, so they're made out of zinc, just kind of like the pennies were made out of zinc. So maybe you guys are looking for a gift for a, a retired vet or, or someone who really does truly um, honor and respect the, the history uh, of things that came from the United States and different, different eras. Um, those are make a great gift. But again, those are the only two zinc doors we have. Um, we are going to list them for our virtual show. But um, if anybody's looking for those for Christmas gifts, the, I, I wouldn't wait too long on those. Thank you for letting us take you on our virtual craft show. We appreciate your time. So we've given you lots of things to look at, lots of our product, a good variety of it. So we are going to take the chance to list all of the banks that you're seeing here with us today on an album for sale on our Facebook page. Um, we are also going to be listing some more banks onto our Etsy page. Uh, we will again link that for you. But any of the banks that you're seeing on Facebook, if you have questions about them or you would like to purchase them, we do take credit cards and we can ship the banks to you if you're not from our area. If you are local to our central Susquehanna Valley here around Sunbury, Seals Grove, Pennsylvania, we would be happy to meet with you and get them to you. Another option, we do run a Sunday stand at the Silver Moon Flea Market, known as the Route 15 Flea Market in Lewisburg, Pennsylvania. We run that on Sundays. We're normally there from about 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. And uh, my dad, who runs Robinson's Custom Woodworking, he's known up there as the Marble Guy. So if anybody wants to come and stop by and see us, we do have a small selection of our banks. We also have a small selection of some of our other pieces. He does custom woodworking. He makes tables like the one you see here. He does cutting boards and engraved signs. So we do have some of those items featured for you up there to see as well. Um, our phone number uh, for our contact mom would be would be 570-850-6032 or 570-850-6031. And those are direct lines to John and Vera. So either of you, uh, either of them, can answer questions that you may have on items that you would see online. Um, again, on Facebook, you can use the message feature on there. There's a, a link to our email address, a link to our website where you, again, can contact us through there, can contact us through our Etsy page as well. Lots of opportunities. Just feel free to reach out to us. Um, it is kind of a crazy busy time, and we're trying our best to get our product to you. Um, since so many of you we have come to know um, through the shows and know that you all come back to us year after year, we do greatly appreciate the continued support and business um, for our company. So, um, again, thanks so much for visiting. Thank and, uh, you, and we really hope to be shipping a bank to you soon. Yes, we do. Thank you. Thanks. Bye.